good morning everybody i am dr bala subramanian tyagarajan today i am going to introduce you to a new e learning tool which will be a potent tool in the arsenal of a teacher and it's called insert learning by the end of this video you will be able to appreciate the real usage of this tool and you will be starting to use this with immediate effect so before i start off i have a few assumptions to make i assume that you already have the chrome browser downloaded and installed in your operating system so the chrome browser is available for windows it is available for linux it is also available for mac os so you can irrespective of the operating system you can download chrome browser and install it to a operating system and now after the browser has been installed and now you need to go to the website insertlearning.com just note down this website it's called insertlearning.com so here this website will open a page which is rather simple and what exactly this tool does is it adds itself as a chrome tool as a chrome plugin and the moment you browse a web page the tool becomes visible and you can convert the web page it could be wikipedia or it could be any other uh, instructional web page you can use the same web page as a teaching tool you can annotate the web page you can create questions on the web page itself for the students to answer you can add a video to the existing web page fantastic isn't it you can add a video believe me i will show you how to do it and then you can add comments you can highlight text all these things can be done and the same uh, learning resource can be ported to a google classroom you can use the resource for your uh, team chat or tea for a session where you use team as a online uh, lecture tool so all these things are possible last but not the least you can create a classroom within this insert learning tool so now let us go to this interesting tool which is called insert learning so now i am going to add this tool to my chrome browser by clicking add to the chrome and trust me it's free now it will ask you to sign up either if you have a existing google account you can use the google account to sign if you have a microsoft account you can use the microsoft account to sign now you sign up the moment you click sign up it will ask you whether you are a teacher or student just choose a teacher and then if you want a class you can name a class if you want i will just say ent or you can say not now so i will prefer not now so now this is a port which has opened now after the insert learning has been inserted now you see the icon here the il so this is a tool suppose if you don't see the tool you can just use here it is unpin use the pin it will get pinned here so it is pinned here the moment you click this tool the moment i will open a website and show you what exactly it does hold on for a minute now i am opening a new browser just to go to the resource i'm going to a uh, one of my sites which contains uh, resources say hey, let let me go to the site let us choose something like what do you mean say anatomy of the 
middle here. I don't know whether it is a book or not. I think we need to choose something else. We will choose this one. Right. And now this is the page which I have chosen. Now if you want to convert this page into a learning resource, you just go see this icon. You click this icon, the moment you click this icon, the entire menu will be displayed on the left side of your screen. So supposing you want to highlight a text on the page, so just click it, it gets highlighted. So the text can be highlighted for the benefit of the student. It can be highlighted. If you want to ask questions pertaining to this highlighted text, all you got to do is just go to more options. And then, sure, I'm sorry, insert a description. Sure, insert a sticky note. This, this is what we should do. Just click it. Here, yeah. you can, you can use uh, embed a video if you want, or let us uh, try an embed a video, YouTube video. 